Hey everybody, it's Pastor Kelly coming at you. We got some really terrible news coming out of Istanbul, Turkey. Um, it seems that the ISIS has done a uh, suicide bombing in a busy marketplace once again. This time, they I feel they were targeting Israelis, uh, which is not good when it comes to Mr. Netanyahu. Uh, he generally retaliates in some sort of way. Uh, it looks to be like that there's been three Israelis killed and one Iranian, and numerous, numerous people have been injured. It was a terrible blast. I'll play part of it here off this site for you, and uh, I warn you, it is pretty graphic. Now, again, I, as I said, it's pretty graphic, and I'm probably going to edit out the first blast part in that video, but I will leave a link for you. What we have going on is these, I feel that, that, that part of this may be in planning through these governments to draw Israel out. Uh, just it's just a bad feeling I have that that's what they're trying to do, and when they know when they draw Israel out, it's all out war over there, folks. You're looking at the final battle coming to place over there. I want to show you something else here real quick. This is a uh, Turkish MP, which is kind of like one of our congressmen here. Uh, they tweeted out right directly after the explosion. They tweeted on Twitter said. Uh, I wish the wounded Israeli tourists were dead. <laughs> Folks, if this is not a draw out of the Israel, if this is not another peck on Israel's doorstep to draw Netanyahu into a wall out war, I don't know what it is. They say they ISIS stepped up and took claimed claimed it right away. Did they? Did it is it ISIS that did it? Well, probably so, but are they connected? Eh, well, that's up to you guys to make that decision. All I can tell you, folks, is it's coming together over there. It's coming together faster than anybody realizes it is. Uh, you need to keep keep yourself alert and, uh, you know, keep looking up. Keep looking up at the Lord and praying that these things will pass. Uh, you know, in, in His in His power and His strength, all things shall pass. If they, if you ask, I've other thing I'd like to ask all of you is, is uh, you know, if you're right with God or if you're saved, if, you, if you're not, you certainly need to get that away because we're not promised our next breath, let alone our next day. And folks, when the Lord comes to take us, you best be ready to go to heaven because if you're not ready to go to heaven, you're going to head straight to hell. Well, I love you. Jesus loves you more. You pray for us. We'll pray for you. I'll leave links. This has been Pastor Kelly. He's out of here.